So alive, make it last forever. Stop in time. with it <laughs> we're gonna be doing a primark social distancing haul and we're gonna stand like this for about one second and then probably just gonna take it in turns to speak to the camera because it's a quite far distance it's just gonna be much easier to manage the distancing if we're in the camera one at a time so this is us together this is the one little shot you got and then roll it we've got a primark haul today the shops are open Woo! And we got some goods. We went to Lakeside Primark, our favourite Primark if you've been watching our channel for a while. And to be fair, the queue was only like 10 minutes. It seemed really long, but it went down quite fast. And yeah, it was quite exciting for us. Um, and we picked up a few bits. So we're going to try it all on. We took all the precautions. They've got loads of like hand sanitizers in the shops at the moment. We wore our masks. Insert a picture of me. We're going to try on all the stuff. We'll show you all the sizes. We'll tell you whether it's good, bad, worth it or not. We do want to say a little disclaimer. We expected a bit more. Yeah, I was actually disappointed. I didn't get that much. Yeah, but we'll we'll kind of tell you as we go. Okay, I guess there's been a worldwide pandemic. As you'll see, there were some really good bits, but again, some things we were just a bit like me. If you do end up going to Primark to get any of the things we picked up in this haul then please do be very careful when you go stay safe and yeah hope you enjoy the video the first item actually i think i might have a couple i know elle's got some bits she's going through her bag now we'll leave her to it um that don't have to properly try on can kind of just show now they have a lot of hats i feel like their summer accessory section bang on this hat oh it's like the Kylie Jenner one, you know when Kylie uploaded, okay, it's not as big as the Kylie one, but you remember when she had that hat and she had like nothing else on? Mm. I hope you can see because I can't really show you without seeing, but this has wiring around the edge, which is unreal. So if you want to get one for an Insta pick, oh, did you even know this? Oh, you can like wiring. mold it. Yeah, you can mold it. That's what drew That's me it. in. So you can literally have it like a literal snake. <laughs> you can shade it on one side i guess it's beneficial for actual practical reasons like if the sun's there mm. but then it's also if you want to get a really cool pick do you know what i mean and this was six pound that is really good really good if you have it like that it looks a bit like a floppy pancake so i would suggest bending it slightly like this okay my first item is also an hot an, a holiday item it is a beach bag and this is probably the first thing i saw when we walked in it is stunning it's a woven bag square shaped bag i actually wish i got one too you could you wish you got that hat too yeah imagine us walking down the beach yeah it's got two little like shaped straps like this and then really handy good isn't it so you can wear it like that obviously sometimes Man, you love this Man's in the house. I really like how that's got a strap actually. I didn't really realise because sometimes when you're all sweaty, you don't want to be carrying your bag um, down the beach. And this actually does not have the price on it. Someone's ripped it off, which is very annoying. But I don't doubt it was any more than like ten pounds. Um, I think maybe twelve. Do you think? I think ten to twelve. Alright, no more than fifteen, definitely. Love this. Hopefully <laughs> we get holidays so i can wear it but okay apologies if the sun is really odd in this video like you are aware we're in the garden it can't be helped mother nature likes to get involved got loads of headbands and stuff i love bandanas and i just think a they're convenient for keeping the sun off your head off your face they're cute for pictures and they're cute for like just a little accessory a lot of people tie bandanas and stuff around their bags and stuff as well got a pink one really really nice these are really affordable as well one pound fifty i'm actually holding a three pack of thongs which i didn't realize but i'll show you anyway <laughs> sorry about that joel sorry about that joel walking past at a perfect time i saw a tweet and it was like um 
I just want to go to Primark and get three pack of thongs. Oh, and I agree. Literally. And these were £2.50. You get three very lovely, cute designs. These are pink with gold dots, pink and then nude. You can never have too many Primark thongs. I got a turquoise bandana, again, £1.50. Elle got this as well, actually. I got this as well. She did, she did. And then I, I like this because of my whole blue vibe at the moment, but I don't think I'm going to use this as much as the other ones because I feel like the traditional bandanas are just so traditional. First of all, I got this blue bandana, which is the same as Sid's, and love a bandana on holiday. I like to feel like Mamma Mia. This is quite funny, so... Primark in Lakeside actually have this brand new section. It's like self-care, isn't it? This like organic packaging. Um, they've got some stuff that looks like from the white company, which you'll see soon. And yeah, it's all very like modern and cute. I've got this face roller, which is like a stone roller and you put your oils on with it and your creams and it's supposed to be really nice for like um, the structure of your face and also just getting things in without touching your face too much so i'm excited to try that i've seen a lot of instagram videos on that and stuff <laughs> i got this little loofah with a handle it's actually quite big and basically i've been getting a few breakouts on my back sorry if that's a bit much but you know keeping it real and look <laughs> i thought i'd try this one so it was only three pound and this was five pounds so yeah not all clothes some good beauty gadgets in primark and yeah that section we were a bit blown away by it was very cute very cute stuff we will try stuff on in a minute but i've just got so many things that aren't try onable so like elle said got one of the rollers for your oils and your face i got a one pound pack of gold hoops if you ever need some jewelry just for stunting on the gram just because I don't know. I wouldn't say these are good to wear all, all the, the time, time because they can make your ears go a little bit green. Some people don't even have this reaction. I feel like it's if you've got certain oils in your skin. They're handy because I lose stuff so much. One pound and you get one, two, three, four, five sets of hoops. Can't go wrong. Actually got a face massager. I don't remember picking this up. Do you remember no. picking it up? <laughs> so this is it helps to reduce the appearance of wrinkles. So you're never too early to start. It literally just has like soft i assume they're soft spiky things and then soft spiky things. well i'm just i hope they're not really sharp because yeah. that's a bit not nice yeah. and you just roll it in i don't know i might have a play with that don't remember getting that but whatever here for it this is from the section that Elle was talking about the self-care section and this is a luxury bamboo headband made with actual bamboos yeah you kind of strap this around your head to your makeup i thought this would be handy for like, when i get out of the shower just keep my hair back off my face and it feels so soft love bamboos thank you really really cute this was two pound okay, these are my last bits before i actually try some stuff on but i picked up some gold hoops as well again so good for some cheap jewelry if you just want some quick fixes and these are just some gold hoops which were one pound fifty and then a three pack because i liked these hoops probably won't wear the other two but worth it for those two pound for three packs of hoops and then I got a bikini, which was exciting. Um, this is just a really basic bikini, but Primark have the best like shapes for that. And yeah, it's like a burnt orange, which we love. And yeah, it's just like a wireless uh, triangle bikini. Wireless, I wonder if we'd have gone there this year. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, just got, got a size eight. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hope they fit but they've got the strings so hopefully they'll be fine they might just be a little bit bummy but that's fine so this next thing is very simple and i have this in black as well and it is literally a vest top this could be an illusion of a bodysuit i do feel like maybe if it was a bodysuit it just wouldn't have the little baggy bits that it could have so i've actually just got my own high-waisted shorts on but we both got items from this material i'm pretty sure i think this is the same like new collection yeah so this is this drew me in because it's really stretchy and it's really thick for primark but it seemed to not affect the price tag so this was six pound and it's like a stone color i'll show you where it finishes just in case you want to wear it as a t-shirt so it's not the, a full length top but then i don't think it's a crop but i love the fit of this very comfy and 
Yeah, I don't think this fills that Primark. I will pop on the black quickly and show you. But Elle's also got something in this colour. I have too many dresses like this. Yeah. In this colour. When you picked it up, I did think. In this fit. She's got that. I know. I, I know. I do have it. But for some reason, I just think they're all so different. They're not. But I just do. But yeah, I actually could not get this because, again, I agree with Sid. This does not feel like Primark at all. It feels a little bit like Zara or... Bershka, that kind of vibe, but yeah, definitely not Primark. It's so nice and thick, but it's something I would wear in the summer because it is like cool and obviously not got sleeves or anything. It is a size medium and it's £13, which is so good for like a long dress. Obviously, you could dress this up. Full outfit. Full outfit, yeah. You could dress this up or you could just chuck it on with flip flops. Um, yeah, I just, it's just me all over, isn't it? I have too much of it, but yeah, had to show you if you want to have more of a affordable dress like this instead of shopping at different shops. This is the exact same top in black. Same size, size small, six pound. And again, just really nice thick rib, nice and simple. If you want to get some nice essential tops, Primark is your one. Whilst I've got a base on, I'm actually going to show you this beautiful shirt which i'm so sure that Elle has it really reminded me of her when i picked it up actually so i have quite a few silky shirts at the moment from zara which are 25.99 and this one cost 10 pound hope you can see in the daylight that this is such a beautiful like sage green and i'm just going to put this on over the top to show that you can wear it with stuff under and open like this it was actually on the hanger tied up nan's whispering in the background that she loves it i knew she'd like this this is in a size 16 so i did go oversized just because i do like a baggy shirt but this would be really cute with just a little tiny white crop top some denim shorts mm. oh adorable so even at the beach with a bikini yeah. underneath so this is from like the home wear white company section again and it's actually like a nighty but putting it on i feel like you could wear it as a dress if you put that on and walked out as a buzz from i'd say zara home yeah it's such nice quality it's like it, it's the only way i can describe it is like that rib from the white company it's, it's like, like a waffle. spa waffle like, is it is yeah. it waffle i really like how it's got like wooden buttons so it just looks really like yeah, it looks really homely, so I guess that's what makes it like a nighty. But again, you could wear this to like the beach or definitely as a dress on holiday. I'd probably wear it as a dress in this hot weather at the moment. Um, or if you're... My mum would probably wear this as a top with jeans. <laughs> nice and cool material. But yeah, I'd probably just sleep in this or like lounge around the house in it. Got this in a small and it is £10, which is so good. Oh, I love it. Do you? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> thanks guys. Okay, it's getting brighter as we're going along in this video, which is so annoying. Really Ooh. sorry about the quality. But this is a swimsuit, which I just said would go really nice with this shirt. And obviously I've just showed you the shirt, so I'm going to show you the swimsuit. But I actually picked this up more as a bodysuit. I think I'd wear it as a bodysuit. I'm not really a massive swimsuit wearer on holiday. I've got a bra underneath just because I quickly put it on. But it's very nice material. As you can see, it's like ribbed, very stretchy. What size did I get in this? This is actually a size eight. I probably should have got a size 10 in this because it does feel quite tight. I think that was an error. And this was six pound. So yeah, very cute if you want to wear it either as a swimsuit or a bodysuit i think i'll go for bodysuit elle's got hers on now so she's gonna show you it on another person <laughs> yeah so i'm wearing it as a bodysuit i've just got on these shorts which are from nasty girl not brown mark but um yeah this is the exact same swimsuit again i saw it as a bodysuit as well but obviously you could definitely wear it <laughs> obviously you could definitely wear it as a swimsuit that's what it is <laughs> I, I mean i would wear it as both um and yeah it's got a nice low back which is really cute and that is all i got like i said i wasn't that impressed like i like the bits that i got but yeah the rest would have just been like, like you can model some of mine really okay next item is these shorts which i am actually obsessed with they say west coast athletic academy washington 1989 
I'm obsessed. Like I was just shouted. I don't know if it would be in the clip, but these are like they're from Hollister. Yeah. They're really nice texture. I don't know what it. What for? Uh, I can't really show you, but because there's a step. So if I step, but it's like a really small waffle. Maybe you can wear them high waisted. That's out of choice, but I just really like the detail. How big they be for like hiking? Yeah. Even working out, working out, around the pool, they're really beach, good. Lounging, lounging, sleeping in pajamas, mm. and I got these in black as well. But no, I got them in navy. Sorry, six pound. I got them in a size small. Each colour says something different. These say Brooklyn, New York, Bronx, 1993, and I can show you the material a bit better actually here. Can they're you see? Like tomboy. Yeah. Okay. Literally obsessed with so these all six pounds. I think there's about three or four colours. There's a pink as well. Navy is really cute. I actually think I originally picked these up to work out and I love working out in shorts, but like I said, million ways to wear them. I'm helping my mate out with some modelling. <laughs> but this is Sid's shirt. And I actually have a shirt like this. I really like it. Can you do it up though? That I wear oh you're gonna wear it as a shirt. I was thinking as like um like a bikini dress. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So can you just lose the shorts, sorry? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so... Is this what happens if you're really rich and you don't want to try stuff on? You should get someone. Yeah, skin. you just get... <gasps> Love it. Yeah. So, I... do you know a shirt that I have like this? No, you... that reminded me of you as well when I picked it up. You did? Yeah. Um, but then, yeah, you could tuck this... You could tie it up. You could tuck it in denim shorts. You could tuck it in as an actual shirt. But you've got to be careful because if you wear it to the beach, then it can get a bit dirty if you actually want to wear it as a shirt. No, I love it. Again, I think it looks like it's from like the work company. Yes. And this was... This oh. was in the just the general Primark section though, not the... Yeah, this was like... The swimwear section. Yeah. Tortoiseshell um, buttons, which is cute. £10 size medium. So yeah, I think this is... Oh, show the back. There's buttons down the back. Is there? Yeah. There's buttons down the back? <laughs> yep. Just down the centre as like a detail. Oh my God, stunning. I might have to oh, go pick this up. I might have to go get this because I do have shell like this, but it's really discoloured from where, how long I've had it. My final try on item is this pyjama set, which actually was in the section that we've keep talking about the kind of self-care section. So this wasn't with the normal pyjamas, but then didn't look in the normal pyjama section. So these might have been there, but they just feel unbelievable. I feel like they feel a lot better quality than normal Primark pyjamas. They've got this ruche detail here. They're so nice and thin and lightweight. Again, they just feel like they're from like Zara Home or the White Company. They're so cute, I'm obsessed. I just love simple pajamas like this. So yeah, 10 pounds, size small, really, really nice. Wish I could put it through the screen so you could feel it. It feels like just so soft and yummy. And I got some sandals. These reminded me of my friend Molly Neville. She's got some strappy sandals from Primark a few years ago and I'm always like, oh, I wish I, wish I got them when they were out. And they actually strap on across like this but then they wrap up around her ankle. So these are quite close. They just have a little buckle and really simple but effective. And I feel like Primark sandals, you can never have too many. Really nice to have, six pound. Okay, I nearly forgot the best thing. It's my spa robe. So this is from the organic section that we were talking about. And it act we've just I've just grasped because in the back it says sustainable cotton so I guess that whole section is just for sustainable items which so many of you guys always say can you do a more sustainable haul like I'm glad that brands are starting to make the sustainable moves for us here we are voila this is beautiful I hope you can see the beautiful waffle texture that it has I actually was gonna pick up this literal exact thing a little bit longer sleeves from the white company and it was 80 pound I was gonna get it when I had 20% off and I'm glad I didn't because I now have this baby This is in a size large and El just said I should have got another one for guests when they stay And now I'm gonna have to go back and get one for guests it, though, When they stay Folded up on their bed even though like I'm not, not treating it like an Airbnb in my own apartment <laughs> I know but like it'll be nice so It's got the little tie detail to keep it on did oh you know? Yeah, I don't know the price, sorry guys, the label's missing, but I think it was about £15. Pound. Did the label's in your arm? You're joking. <laughs> How much do we think it is then? There. Yeah, I can feel it now. It was £16. Pounds. 
but that is everything that we got in this Primark haul like we said if you go to Primark and get any of these bits be careful take your masks gloves hand sanitizer social distance what gloves mask hat <laughs> like scarf <laughs> it's good to be back doing Primark hauls obviously hopefully as time goes on we can do some more Primark videos best friend challenges etc etc so yeah that is everything I got as well and I'm trying to think what favourite thing I picked up was probably my holiday bits um, maybe the white shirt and the beach bag and my white shirt for you and your white shirt that I'm going to take it wasn't the best Paramount haul but it was very exciting to go back and can't wait to go back again maybe we'll go back next week hope you guys enjoyed and yeah this is the first Paramount haul in a long time if you want to go to Paramount like we said be careful and give this video a thumbs up subscribe and we'll see you soon goodbye